A new book is shedding light on President Trump's battle to push ahead with one of his signature policies, securing the U.S.-Mexico border. According to the book, Mr. Trump suggested shooting migrants in the legs. He reportedly made the suggestion in March during a meeting where he also called for the entire border to be closed. Two New York Times reporters wrote the book, which is published by Simon & Schuster, a division of CBS. Paula reads at the White House. Paula, why did the president allegedly make these comments? Anthony, earlier this year, as border crossings hit record numbers, the Times reports the president grew increasingly frustrated with the situation along the southern border and intent on delivering on his campaign promises to build a wall and deter illegal immigration. He started throwing out some new ideas. We're closing the border. They'll close it and we'll, we'll keep it closed for a long time. I'm not playing games. In late March, President Trump publicly threatened to close the U.S.-Mexico border. But according to the Times reporters, in a March meeting, the president's advisors tried to turn him away from such a drastic move. He responded, you're making me look like an idiot, and shouted, I ran on this. It's my issue. Administration officials were constantly having to kind of walk the president back from the precipice, right? Mm -hmm. Walk him back from the edge of what could be a crisis. Michael Scheer and Julie Hirschfeld Davis are the reporters and authors of the book Border Wars, Inside Trump's Assault on Immigration. He made all these promises. He talked in these grandiose ways about things he wanted to do when he was in office. But then he comes in and confronts the reality of governing. The article also details the president's other suggestions to stem migration. They want to throw rocks at our military, our military fights back. We're going to consider it. I told him, consider it a rifle. And while he said he didn't mean to shoot migrants if they threw rocks at Border Patrol agents, the New York Times reports that the president later suggested they shoot migrants in the legs to slow them down. They write he also privately talked about fortifying a border wall with a water-filled trench stocked with snakes or alligators. And he wanted the wall electrified with spikes on top that could pierce human flesh. We've reached out to the White House for comment on this report, but have not heard back. As of August, 57 miles of border wall have been built, but hundreds of miles remain and costs are mounting. The Pentagon has diverted approximately $6.1 billion for this project. Gail. All right, Paula, thank you.